it was good against evil. Blackjack would say, get mama from the kitchen. We gotta be there because if he takes over, you know, it's gonna be the end of the world. <laughs> the age of the fall thing, which was your basic invasion or new stable, but we took advantage of, of online and the internet and created a buzz for it, and that's how we modernized it. The problem is, is that it's it's a retirement home right now, and at the same time, they still take guys that should be their top stars. And if you don't come from WCW or WWE, you're always seen as a young upcomer. Here comes some old friends of yours, right? From yeah. That maybe you worked with there yeah. at TNA. Maybe one's got bleach blonde hair. And big yeah. Yeah. I'm just a Kevin baby. Yeah, good to see you again. I'm really, really got some great ideas. I was able to give my ideas right up to uh, Russo over there, so I assume it's going to be the same here. Uh -uh. I mean, how do you say that to someone you've known uh -uh. for 30 years? Uh-uh. That's it. Uh-uh. <laughs> You're going to do him a favor? Are you going to refuse to do a favor? I didn't say you're losing tonight. He's winning. I said, will you do him a favor? So right now, I'm out of the equation. It's between you two. You know, I put myself out of the, the equation. Taskmaster yeah, I put, work. I put myself out of the equation. You know, the best thing you try to do is is be upfront with it, and you know, and just do it. I mean, that's it's it's like pulling off a band aid. You can get away with guys that are talkers on top for a while, but you better have somebody underneath that your building that's an athlete and can wrestle that will learn to be able to speak because after a while if you're around great talkers by osmosis you should get something and we're gonna bring them over into WWE and the way we're gonna do this is we're gonna take these guys and uh, they have to wrestle a WWE guy and the loser of that is gonna be sent packing these guys and I'm probably gonna get a lot of heat for saying this they're not throwing 50 touchdown passes a year. None of them are hitting 300. They're winning a belt that is decided who wins. With Samoa Joe, when we had him as champion, he was a very old school champion. He was the big unbeatable guy. And like, like Kevin was saying about the Sheik, or somebody like that, like people believed in Samoa Joe back then. So it was a matter of making people believe in it, but we did in a different way with Samoa Joe where he kind of had a, a modernized style. There's a way to make a huge baby face from one of these young guys. I would take a baby face who you thought, you know, if we were collectively doing this, who you thought you came to me and you said, Kevin, this is the guy. And I said, okay. Who's the guy? We have the unification match with the, with the champion, so we have one champion, and then we do the sting, the lights go crazy and everything, the scorpion comes on, and boom, there's Angle in the ring, and Angle's beating up the new champion. And then here comes everybody to the ring, the lights go out again, there's the scorpion thing, here's the guys that WWE screwed over the years. The young guys that you were gonna cut from here, mm -hmm. Because certainly these young guys over here are a lot more talented than some of these older guys over here. Yeah. It's like old Twilight Zone, you know? Yeah. If you don't fit in this mold, you know, you don't work for the state. The state is all powerful and all good. The state is all powerful and all good. The state is all powerful and all good. You just increase the intensity each week with it. And this is only on the internet. He's not on television. It's only on the internet, but he's also, you're putting him on, on every talk show from Des Moines, Iowa to New York City that will, will take him on, and he's running his mouth on every single one of these things. Hey, did you get a letter in the mail? Yeah. Yeah, I got one of those. You think it's a rib? Certified says we're fired. I thought this contract was good. <laughs> Down the bottom it says, yeah, but it can be terminated for any kind of infraction. You know what I mean? You wore a t-shirt. I always wondered where Seth, Cain, and Abel went to land of the Nod and got their wives. You know, they begot their wives. All right, for Christ's sake. Yeah. <laughs> TNA.